guys, welcome to The Hollywood Social. I'm Tori. And I'm Martha. And we'll be bringing you the latest celebrity news. What do you got? Okay, so did you by any chance watch the MTV Movie Awards? No, I didn't. What happened? Okay, so Selena Gomez performed at her, her new song called Come and Get It. It's kind of scandalous, but it's a really good song. I heard it was like they, they're thinking it's about the Biebs or whatever. Yeah, mm -hmm. but it's not. She claims it's not. But no. that's not what... That's not the scandal? That's not the scandal. What the scandal is, is that this Hindu group wants to sue her. During the performance, she was wearing a bindi. Which is the... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they were just, they're going to sue her because um, she's not Hindu and that was kind of something racist and they just... I don't think she was making fun of it though, no, right? No, she wasn't because it's kind of like, that song has a Bollywood feel to it. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, That's I don't weird. know. Well, in completely unrelated news, do you remember who Ryan Lochte is? Yes, that swimmer. <sighs> okay, well he has a show coming out on E! And... It's his little reality show, which I don't get why he's getting a reality show. Why not? Kim Kardashian. That girl deserves a show. But anyway, I just, I don't know. So he's been going on this big press tour, right? Uh-huh, yeah. And he recently went to a morning show where he was literally laughed at to his face. The host literally, because they said he would just, like, look at the camera and his eyes would be really dead and he wouldn't know what to say and he would just stop. And the hosts were laughing at him. Like, how That's can this guy terrible. have this TV show? He can't talk in a complete sentence. But look at him. He has I don't think appeal. he's that cute. I mean, you have to be able to talk a little bit, right? Really? Yeah, I kind of want someone to talk. Well, it looks like he's talking a lot in his new show. But I don't know if it'll make sense, but hopefully. Anyway, I, I just don't like him. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, we get that you don't like Ryan Lockney anymore. So I'm pretty sure you heard about this other scandalous story. Farrah from Team Mom. <gasps> She's my favorite. Yeah. Well, maybe that's. this is going to change your perspective on her. She made a sex tape. Well, okay, so has she well, come out and claimed it once? Okay. Or? That's what a lot of the magazines and uh, rumors are going around that she made a sex tape. And the guy she did it with actually came out in public on Twitter and mm -hmm. on Facebook and was like, yeah, you know, we made a sex tape. And at first, Farrah was like, no, we didn't do it. But then she came out with some bikini photos or something mm -hmm. like that. And um, all the media outlets took it as, you know, she was saying that. So has okay, she confirmed yet that she's done yeah. it? Yeah. So she did make a sex tape. So why would you deny it, though, if he had the sex tape? Like, because I feel like sense. she was embarrassed at first. I mean, yeah, I do too. But if you're going to be embarrassed, just don't make a sex tape. Exactly. Fair was right. dumb from Tori. So, <laughs> and for our last story, the love of my life, Taylor Swift, um, she has to go buy a new house. Because if you remember, she bought a big mansion right next to Connor Kennedy's estate. Mm -hmm. Well, they broke up. So she flipped <laughs> the house and actually made almost a million dollars off of it. Wow. But now she needs a home again. And she doesn't have a boyfriend. Where is she going to live? So all the media sources are, you know, just kind of joking about where is she going to go. Is she not going to find another boyfriend? I think she should find the boyfriend then the house. Mm -hmm. Or, you know, maybe this is a new approach to get a house and then to see, like, the radius around it of all yeah. the guys and be like, which one am I going to date? Oh, but <laughs> Taylor, slow it down this time. <laughs> but, you know, I still love you, Tay. True to my heart. But, yeah, that's been The Hollywood Social. Thank you guys for tuning in. And we'll be back next week. Love ya. Hey guys, don't forget to pick up a copy of The Prairie out every Tuesday.